right, YouTubers. I have the Panasonic FZ80 4K camera here. This uh, shoots at 30 frames per second. I've got max settings for all the video. So I've done a bunch of comparisons of all the, the cell phones I have, uh, their 4K ability. And then this is, this is a much more high-end uh, recording device as far as 4K goes. And so you'll have the ability to uh, see uh, if you look at the videos of the other ones, compare how good a quality it is uh, for those cell phones compared to a uh, what you should expect from real 4K uh, video recording. So one thing those things cannot do that this one can is zoom in a ridiculous amount. Of course, uh, that a tripod is kind of unstable. Um, and then it probably is one to focus on a bunch of other crap. But uh, I'll zoom in up here. So this has a 60x optical zoom, which is ridiculous. A lot of times you're just too close to stuff. So, all right. Um, let me do a little shake test here. None of the videos will be... Um, in none of the videos am I going to actually use any kind of stabilization software so you can kind of see raw what it does let's go inside a negative of this is it does not have a pause button so we gotta continue to shoot All right, once again, we are in our basement kitchen. This is uh, actually not really that low of light. All right, just so you can see. Um, got the dimmers on. A little dimmer, a little dimmer, a little dimmer, and boom, all the way. Um, some of the good cameras, you can actually read the print on the uh, bulb. And I'm not sure if you can do it with this one. So that would be one possible negative if it does not have that. And let's see. So I've been using the same Predator movie for these. Just so you can see. Um, let's go switch this over. You can see how well it reads the, uh, the text. Now I'm not using the macro button. Um, if I did switch over the macro button, it really would not be a fair contest at all. I would basically be able to set this lens. Well, actually, I, without the macro button, I can set it on there. So out of all the cameras, this one appears to have the best ability to read print. And I don't even have the macro button on. So, but hey, that's this video. Please like, please subscribe. Expect more cameras, iPhone 10s, all the new iPhones. I will be uh, eventually reviewing them at some point. Thank you.